James, thank you very much. Glad you enjoyed your feast today. I've got a scrambled egg tonight. That's going to be completely well, different, isn't not, it? Not <laughs> probably what they had at Stonehenge. Oh, probably no. not. <laughs> All right, now, uh, stand by, get yourself prepared, because it's going to be a stormy weekend. It certainly is, yes. We have some weather pictures for you. Steve Hogan took this picture of Portlandville Lighthouse at sunset last night. Uh, Martin Dolan captured the mist here. This is from Dorset. And Sharon Todd with HMS Warrior under the cloudy skies in Portsmouth. We did have some bright spells today, but a good deal of cloud and, in fact, some fog earlier on this morning eventually lifted. Overnight tonight, some heavy rain at times and strong winds. We could see gusts along the south coast of 60 miles per hour, the winds rattling their way through, and the rain could be quite heavy at times. But there will be some drier periods as well. Temperatures tonight will fall to a mild 11 to 13 Celsius. So a damp start for many tomorrow, but it will be an improving picture. Through the course of the day, the rain will clear, the skies will clear as well, and we'll start to see some sunshine break through during the afternoon. Afternoon. Not everyone will see the sunshine, but there will be some sunny spells, and as a result, temperatures will reach a high of 14 to 15 Celsius. It's tomorrow evening that the winds will strengthen once again. So through the early hours of Saturday morning, it's going to be very windy indeed. Van der Rey will move its way in with the strong winds during the course of tomorrow night, and showers will follow. Temperatures will drop away to around 11 to 12 Celsius, so some really quite heavy rainfall during the first part of tomorrow night, gradually easing during the early hours of Saturday morning. Saturday Saturday itself, well, that's Storm Brian, which is moving its way in from the Atlantic. Along the south coast, we could potentially see wind gusts of 70 miles per hour, inland wind gusts of 50 to 60 miles per hour. Storm Brian moving its way in, staying with us through the daytime on Saturday. That's when we'll see the strongest winds expected around lunchtime. Not only the winds, we are expecting some very large waves with the high tides at the moment. The chance we could have some coastal flooding, so do stay tuned to your local BBC radio station and avoid coastal stretches because the winds and the waves will be very strong. Over the next few days, and the outlook's frozen, unfortunately, but we are going to go to the backup outlook for you. We can expect a few um, showers tomorrow morning, but the rain will clear and we'll see some sunshine eventually during the course of the day. We have had a good deal of cloud this week. Some sunny spells to be had on Saturday, but also some very heavy showers at times. And that Met Office wind warning is in force. Gusts along coastal stretches of up to 70 miles per hour. Still windy on Sunday and less in the way of rain. Sally. Does look turbulent, doesn't it? it good does. backup there. Very good Great. backup. Yeah, yeah. Genius, yeah. Isn't it? That's it from us. There is of course more at eight o'clock and then again at ten thirty. Thanks for joining us this evening. We're back tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night.